you have the power to manifest all your goals, desires and dreams. And today I am giving you a very quick, effective and easy technique or a process. Once you start implementing, you will start having incredible result. Yes, incredible result in your manifestation process. And this is so simple but so effective. Once you start implementing for next 30 days, you will have significant change and massive manifestation in your journey. Are you ready for it? I am sure you are. Hey, hello awesome tribe. This is Awesome Aze, your mentor, guide and coach in your personal transformation. And I'm so happy and excited to see all of you manifesting your goals, desires and dreams. And today I'm giving you a very, very, very powerful process that will significantly enhance your power of manifestation and you start having incredible results. So if you are new here, hit the subscribe button and the bell icon and be a part of our awesome tribe. Now, so many of you are aware that your thoughts and your words create your manifestation. That's how you are releasing the vibration in the universe. So if you want to raise your power of manifestation, no matter what kind of techniques or what kind of processes you are using, there are some reprogramming you have to do at a very deeper level. And I want all of you to follow it for at least next 30 days so that you will see significant change. The first one is you have to memorize as many positive words as possible. Yes. See, your memory is the storehouse of all the ideas, thoughts that you are having. Like when people say like, oh, I'm just kidding or I'm not happy or I'm stressed out or I'm sad or I'm jealous. When they have something positive like, oh, I'm feeling awesome, I'm excited, I'm happy, I'm joyful. Where all these words comes from? All these words are there inside your memory. All these words that you have been repeating again and again, they are residing inside your memory bank. And where the memory is there? It's there inside the subconscious mind. So one big thing that has been proven in many studies that the kind of words that you are using dictates the amount of success you will be having in life. Yes, the kind of words that you are using or having inside your head is going to dictate the kind of success that you are having. Now, people who are going through a lot of pain or suffering or illness, they usually keep repeating the words which are negative. Like for example, uh, maybe 20 or 30 years back, uh, being stressful was not very common. People are not talking about stress and anxiety so much. But then stress become a major part of our life and then everyone started talking about oh I'm stressful, I'm stressful, I'm stressful and so many people started using stress so much then stress has become a normal thing. Then people started talking about oh I'm highly stressed, I'm highly stressed. Only st being stressful was not enough that people started being highly stressed out and then Slowly it has become that, oh, being stressful is normal. And same way these days being depressed, being stressful, being anxious has become normal living. Why? Because those words have been implanted in our subconscious mind and we have been talking about and using these words again and again. Same way, if you go to a particular house or a family and if you find that most of the people are going through illness, then you will surprise to find if you carefully listen to their words, you surprise to find that most of the time they are talking about illness, anxiety, stress, negativity and even if someone is not yet having any illness, he or she is talking more about oh people are becoming diabetic at the age of 40, everyone is having high blood pressure, everyone is having heart disease, oh everyone is going through cancer. So. When they are using these words more often, you are getting ready for these illnesses. You are getting ready for more negativities. So you have to protect yourself. You have to reprogram. You have to change that memory bank that you have from you have to remove the negative words and store more and more of positive words. Same way when you go to a mastermind or when you meet highly successful people, they keep talking about, oh, everything is going to work out, success is easy, everything is working out, uh, it's going to be awesome, I'm having an amazing day, I'm having a beautiful day, oh, everything is easy for me, all my meetings are successful, everything that I touch turns into gold, oh, my business is growing fast, oh, my career is moving forward, oh, my health is getting better, oh, my relationships are magical. So, what is the big difference? People who are going through suffering or failures, 
दे ऑल्सो वॉन्ट टू बी सक्सेसफुल एंड हैप्पी बट अनकॉन्सियसली दे आर स्टोरिंग लॉट ऑफ नेगेटिविटीज और नेगेटिव वर्ड्स इन साइड देयर मेमरी and that is why no matter how much they want to have a positive or happy life they are not able to come out of it whereas people who are highly successful or happy or growing in life it doesn't mean that they are not facing challenges or obstacles in life it doesn't mean they are succeeding all the time but because they are focused more and more and more on the positive words more and more on the words which can inspire them which can raise your their vibration they are achieving more success their probability of achieving or efficiency of achieving success has gone higher so the number one thing i want all of you to do is to remember and memorize more and more positive words and focus less on the negative words start using ask yourself think deep inside do an introspection and ask yourself what kind of words you are using more and more and you will realize that if you are going through lot of pain and suffering you are talking more about negativities if you are going through relationship issues most of the time you are talking about jealousy you are talking about breakup you are talking about pain you are talking about suffering you are talking about uh, cheating you are talking about betrayal whereas if you want to have great relations if your focus should be on love on alignment on joy on prosperity on faith in trust in having a magical moment same way in all areas of life it's about money if you are talking about debt and and pressure and bills all the time then you are never going to have an abundant life if you want to have an abundant life you have to talk about prosperity abundance money even if now you have little bit of money but when you start talking about abundance and get ready for it you start having more money so this is one of the most important thing because where your thoughts and feelings are coming from from that memory bank that you have inside your subconscious mind feel it with more and more positive words and then everything will change so what i want you to do today is today take a journal and you write down first what are the negative words that you are using all the time what are the negative words you are using all the time and you note it down and then ask yourself okay what should be the positive words that i should be using and then note them down or if you are using some negative word like stress anxiety all the time then ask yourself what could be the positive words replacing them so it should be being peaceful being joyful being happy you write it if it's about breakup pain suffering then you write that magical relationship happy relationship joyful relationships same way money if it's about debt or it's about bills then write it it's about abundance it's about prosperity it's about being a money magnet so i want all of you to do this exercise right now and ask yourself what are the positive words and then you make a sheet of paper where you write all the positive words you want to feed inside your subconscious mind and keep this paper with you or in front of you maybe at your home maybe at your office desk and for next 30 days every day at least glance at this paper and read these words if you can read it many times it would be great this is one simple tip which is going to create a massive 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 change in your life and right now if this video is an i opener for you if this video has inspired you i want you to write few key positive words that you really want to feed in your subconscious mind in the comment section it doesn't matter which area it belongs to whether it's belong to health whether it's belong to money whether it's belong to relationship whether it's belong to overall well being or it's belong to all areas go to the comment section and write as many positive words that you want to feed inside your subconscious mind the positive words that are going to be residing in your memory for ever from right now so if this video has inspired you if this video is an eye opener for you then like it comment and share it with someone you love because this simple tip this simple technique this simple process can create massive 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 change in your life thank you thank you thank you this is awesome is it if you want to learn more tools techniques and processes you can join my powerful program make your life awesome if you are new here in our awesome tribe hit the subscribe button and the bell icon and be a part of our awesome tribe thank you